Thank you guys for tuning in on this episode. We'll be making plantain porridge with coconut milk and we'll just get right into it because no time delay. So for our ingredients, we're gonna need uh, coconut milk or whatever milk of your choice. I am dairy free. Uh, we're gonna need cinnamon, either cinnamon leaves or, see? Can I use the powder or can I use the leaves? The leaves normally give me a better taste, you know, because I put the leaves to boil in the water, give you that stronger taste. And you're definitely gonna need coconut for me because this is my milk and I'm going to make the milk first. And two planted, green planted, very green. Not half ripe, not full ripe, very green. See? This, I don't know what it is, but you need to plant it to be very green. So we're gonna get into our coconut here, our friend right here. We need to make this coconut milk if anything gonna taste good. Trust me. This coconut is gonna be lovely. So first thing, I'm gonna mash my coconut. to do this kind of work but this is kind of tradition for us you know? so let's use the hammer how much it cook and in less than a minute in less than a minute we have all our coconut ox out. We're gonna blend it now. After you ox out the coconut, the next step is to make some coconut milk. You want to wash off the coconut and load it in the blender like this. And you're gonna just add some water. We'll do about, let's say, 1.5 liters. Let's get some water in. Spring water because it's make your after and pipe water and this is milk that you're gonna eventually want to drink like your regular milk because it is our regular milk so here we got our cinnamon leaves You want to wash your cinnamon leaves before you add it to your water. You don't know what was on it before or what could be on it before you put it in the pot. So you want to put the cinnamon leaves inside of the pot and to get that cinnamon flavor all over your pot. It's like making cinnamon tea. But for this now we're gonna add our plant the recipe to it. Okay, so five cups of water for this that I'm doing. It's me, my wife, and my child. So we're just gonna drink a lot of porridge for breakfast. So yeah, just add that to the thing. And uh, we're gonna deal with the coconut right now. We're gonna work the blender, you know? So looking at the coconut in the blender, it seems as if it is ready. 
and I'm gonna strain with a cheesecloth. You can use a strainer, but I like the smaller grade. <laughs> to blend with our plantain to make our plantain porridge. So our next step is to get this plantain out of their shell. And it's easy. Cut the top, cut the bottom, and then slip along the back. Planting is yellow and looking nice. Can break it on us. Drop it in the blender. Okay. So our coconut milk, we're gonna add roughly about two cups. This is half cup, so so that is one cup, one and a half, two. What we're going to do now is that we're going to blend the plantain, but we don't want it too blended out. So we just pause the, 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 the blender and just get that smooth, not too silky, but smooth blend more. Alright, so. And this is the grid that we are looking for. See? Not too smooth, but not too chunky. And we're just gonna add it to the pot. Our fire is on medium and we'll just stir for like 30 seconds. And then we'll go ahead and add our spices, that is our nutmeg, vanilla, and then we'll just sit and let it cook. And it should be ready in 10 minutes or so. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to let this um, cook for five minutes and then I'll go ahead and add some more coconut milk and it will all that smell in the kitchen it smell as if it is definitely done yes and it looks like it's done smooth yeah and I will just go ahead and add my sugar or is sweet now, whatever your choice is. I'll be using sugar today. Cane sugar to be exact. Yeah, so I just add my sugar. And what it is really is just sweeten to taste or to your preference, whatever you whatever you like is, you know, but don't add too much sugar. You don't want to be making sugar porridge. And when you add the sugar to the hot porridge, what it does is that 
The sugar is break down by the heat, you know, faster. I'll just stir and I am done. I'll just turn my stove off and put back the cover on and that's a thumbs up. Yeah, so this is the plantain porridge where we just make, you know, can't see the steam. Smells rich. Smells like that coconut milk. Smells like burnt coconut milk. You know, burnt coconut milk is like, it's like a sweetie. I don't know how, but when it's burnt, it's lovely. So yeah, take a look. See, thick and nice. So yeah guys, thank you for tuning in and that's it, you know, quick and easy planting porridge and we need to have 15 minutes, that's about it, make you some nice, healthy, strong porridge. So like, subscribe, comment if you have any comments and share it with your friends and make it be a thing that you watch almost every morning because you're going to need to try this.